So, the new Battlefield 4. Recently, unless you've been living in a hole, had your head in the ground, or just don't really care too much for Battlefield 4, it has had a, received a massive update and has finally come out of beta and gone to generation 1, well, version 1.0, which is extremely exciting because I've been sick of all these half ass games and I've got nothing to play. So, pretty much what has happened is they have made it so that the hitch registration actually fucking works. So, this was my very first game on, ended up going 17. Uh, 70 for 19 I mean and this just proves I thought that I was just a bad player at Battlefield you know my play style just didn't suit Battlefield but it actually turns out that most of it's the hit registration I'm not I'm no longer getting hit round corners I've only died uh, once from a traded kill and that's out of 11 games usually I used to die at least once or twice a game and I haven't died from anyone on zero HP so these are very good improvements also that the um, assault rifles have been toned down in strength they now are 24 damage over long range which means that it takes five bullets to kill somebody which means you have to have more consistent aim which really helps with me because I love aiming down sight I find it very rewarding especially getting a kill on someone who was firing at me first so as you can see, throughout this gameplay, hit registration is just absolutely beautiful. I'm extremely excited. Um, I've been playing a lot of pistol-only servers as well, and it's just, it's just perfect. Like, um, I'm absolutely in love with this game at the moment. It's playing full flawlessly, and without this patch, like beforehand, I uh, I was over rushing a lot of the times, and I was dying even though I was around a corner. And this was became extremely frustrating to me. I was dying a lot to zero HP people just because the hit bullet registration hadn't quite registered the person was dead, and the server was not updating in time. Now, it, now, it's just crisp. It's definitely worth it. You can uh, escape from gunfights. You can duck back round, everything like that. Still, unfortunately, they have not added a punch a fuckhead button yet. What a punch a fuckhead button is is um, I've been playing a lot of pistol only servers as I've said, and a lot of people are selfish. So. Mainly pistol only servers are hardcore and no one drops med packs. I run support to keep dropping myself and my other teammates ammo as it seems that no other retard realises that there's any other class other than medic. So I drop my team some um, ammo everywhere I can. As, as soon as my um, ammo pack's ready to go, I'm dropping it out for them. But it seems that the 10,000 medics that are on my fucking team do not realise that people need med packs to survive to go on a good streak. So I went on a really good tear. Unfortunately, I didn't record it. I went for a 58 and 9 in a 300 kill TDM environment, pistol only. And um, I could have gone probably flawless if my team bothered to drop me medi packs. I died at least five times while spamming the Q button to scream at my teammate to drop me a medi pack. But. Unfortunately, that's how it goes. Everyone's a little retard and they're still learning how to play this game. You know, I'm only level 23 or 24, I think. And I still can play better than some of them, which is uh, pretty bad considering I'm a COD fag and not a Battlefield elitist. But yeah, so uh, I'm that's all I want to say. I'm extremely happy with Battlefield 4. If you have stopped playing it or um, never bought it to begin with, if you're looking for a game to tie you over to Advanced Warfare or if you're waiting for Battlefield Hardline, definitely get Battlefield 4 now. Uh, I believe it's cheaper. Hit registration, as I said, is absolutely beautiful. It is better than any Call of Duty game by miles. I promise you that. It is so good. It's so responsive, automatically responsive, and... I just can't falter at the moment. I'm absolutely in love with it. But, you know, it's 99% good. The only problem I've had is I'm still trading kills. Well, I've traded one kill, which means that problem is still there. But that's fine by me. You know, it's only happened to me once in 11 games, so that's not too bad. Uh, they've also toned down how many grenades you have and the blast radius of grenades, which um, I'm extremely happy about, especially because I play a lot of hardcore, which means that uh, people won't be spamming nades which is fantastic for me. But anyway, guys, I've been Trace. I'm out. Hope you enjoyed the commentary.